Well, let's talk education now. There is the need to strengthen governance to bring about positive impact in basic education in Nigeria. Now, these came out on the sideline of a program for government side actors with oversight in the governance of basic education in Nigeria. The program sought to provide feedbacks to the government side on monitoring of UBE project and observations and also give an opportunity for thorough reflection on performance. Organizers of the event, the Human Development Initiatives, sought to build capacity and governance of basic education and emotional intelligence towards achieving quality delivery of services. One of the speakers says governance is important as it is the operational head that guides basic education in the country. So we just felt that um, even with working, all the jobs, the tax, everything, we need, aside from that one is um, intelligence that can help them in doing that. We also felt that, okay, let's add emotional intelligence because of the environment. Everybody is under pressure. If you don't manage your emotions, you can react negatively. And, you know, many people have different perceptives. You come from different backgrounds. You come around to come and work together. People have different values, principles, beliefs. So if you don't manage all these emotions, you won't be able to work effectively. But if you go to build multi-stakeholder approach into effective basic education, even in Lagos and across. You know, it has to be steered by, by, by a particular sector. You know, it cannot be a facade, it cannot be without, without organization, it cannot be without focus. If the governance level is strengthened, then we build the capacity to leverage on the, both the soft skills and the hard skills to be able to reach out to all the stakeholders. And now, you know, now government cannot do it alone. So the, the people at the governance threshold at that level must be able to be strengthened, must recognize the the need to be able to leverage on the skills within, inherent and without, external, to be able to reach to other stakeholders. For the government side, the interactive session brought an opportunity to identify challenges in the area of project monitoring and supervision, as well as build capacity in areas of emotional intelligence. The session also featured the review of observations and notices on the EcoExcel project and concluded with the drafting of a strategy document for actualizing quality basic education. Well, that is our mandate, uh, that is our function to ensure that we provide basic education services in the state. And we cannot do that alone. That is why we are uh, seeking the collaboration of uh, uh, other agencies, non-governmental organizations, well-meaning Nigeria to assist us. Uh, in order for us not to leave any child behind, you know, it takes the responsibility, it takes the collaboration, it takes the cooperation of everybody. It takes the whole village to educate a child. Still ahead on Plus News Now. Africa Centre for Disease Control says it is eager for delivery of second COVID-19 vaccines. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.